I don't know who needs to hear this, but if you are a black woman and you know you have a good black man at home, you need to do what it takes to keep that black man. Because let me tell you something, there are not a lot of available good black men out here that are still interested in dating black women. So let me just hit you with some facts. And so then there's a large percentage of those black men that are incarcerated. There's another percentage of those men that are just into men. It's just the world that we live in. There's another percentage of those men that are already taken and married. And a lot of them are not marrying the black women. So mm. when you do come across a black man that is single and we interrupt this program to prescribe you with a thousand milligrams of red vitamins. Right here, right here, right now, right now. It's the right time, right time, right time. It's the right time, right now, right now, right now, right now, right now. Right now. Tell the whole pipe down, pipe down. What's good, Shadow Realm? It's your boy Reclaim Your Throne coming at you with another crazy video. But first, my goal is to get to 10,000 subscribers by the end of the month. So make sure you go ahead and like, comment, share, subscribe, and you already know. Reclaim Your Throne. I don't know who needs to hear this, but if you are a black woman and you know you have a good black man at home, you need to do what it takes to keep that black man. Because let me tell you something, there are not a lot of available good black men out here that are still interested in dating black women. So let me just hit you with some facts. And so then there's a large percentage of those black men that are incarcerated. There's another percentage of those men that are just into men. It's just the world that we live in. There's another percentage of those men that are already taken and married. And a lot of them are not marrying the black women. So so when you do come across a black man that is single and good and actually willing to date a black woman, how do you ensure that he is actually desiring you and wants to commit to you? Okay, here's another fact. The number of black men who are marrying outside of their race has drastically increased, which simply just means they are not picking us. And that is a big concern for me. So you got to ask yourself, what is it about you that makes us less desirable? That is what we have to figure out because the men do desire to be in a relationship they're getting married and they're outnumbering us in marriages they're just not picking us mm. so it's time to really figure out how can i be different <laughs> now that is a real red vitamin for yo behind okay um i've done a review on the woman who actually made this original audio and she didn't say anything wrong. She's absolutely correct in her analysis of how the game is going when it pertains or as it pertains to black men. And the reality is that black men are exploring options elsewhere. And this is something that a lot of sisters are fretting about online. Now, are they really trying to make a change are they really trying to do the things that brothers are saying that they need from a woman no absolutely not if you tell one of these sisters to clean for you they're not going to do it if you tell one of these sisters to cook for you they're not going to do it or even know how to do it um if you ask them you know to <laughs> not go to the club if you ask them to not do girls trips they are going to continue to live their life and they're going to talk, call you toxic, controlling and abusive if you try and inhibit any of their movements that could be to the detriment of the relationship while also simultaneously putting restrictions on what the man can do. So a lot of brothers have wisened up and they're just saying no to that. All right. And, and they are choosing other ways like SYSBM. They are choosing other ways like IR dating, interracial dating. They are choosing other ways like becoming passport bros and going overseas to potentially find some afro latinas or some sisters from the motherland but they are refusing especially the high caliber black men now obviously we have the thug max alpha sims they are going to continue to date black women but i have seen a lot of thug maxes dating out too so um it the thug maxes but overall i think those are the types of men that most of the sisters are getting dealing with and complaining about online and we all know this because the thug max alpha simp rules in the community he is 
pretty much the top of the pecking order as to what sisters are attracted to. So it's a combination of them not knowing how to be that dutiful virtuous woman to a brother a black man and then it's also a combination of them being attracted to the thug max alpha simp who is going to be a poor representation of who black men really are so we have a a, 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 a dual dynamic going on in the community when it comes to sisters and brothers have seen this a, a mile away and they are choosing to date out expeditiously as you guys can see, um, these are the top brothers of the society, whether you like to admit it or not, when it comes to athleticism, earning potential, all that, all right, body type, right? This is what a lot of sisters want, but they, you know, they also want him to be thug maxed as well. So, um, you know, you're seeing a lot of these athletes, and it's not just athletes, it's professional black men. Actually, 33% of black men who do graduate college date out. So it's and we're presuming that, you know, um, I mean, the data still shows that having a college education, um, you know, on average will give you a higher earning potential. So we're seeing these dynamics and we're seeing these numbers. And then we're also seeing numbers of single motherhood skyrocket, increase, okay? We're also seeing numbers of red flag women increase, skyrocket. So, uh, I mean, it's really slim pickings on both sides. I would say, I always say this, is just as hard as a, uh, it's just as hard for a black man to find a good solid sister that it is for a sister to find a good solid black man and i just say that to kind of even out the odds me personally i really believe that it's way easier to find a good man than a good woman um and, and that's just it is what it is that's just the society and the environment that we are in today but if he is not thug max then the sisters don't want him just like asian doll said she wanted a guy who had at least three bodies who had who had committed at least three murders but what do we see now she recently tweeted and i did a video on it of her saying oh i want a nice guy now these hood ninjas or these street ninjas are played out da, 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 da. these trap ninjas are played out yeah they're played out now that you're getting older and that you've had your fun with the street ninjas while also being in love with uh, her deceased um, ex-boyfriend so i mean th this is how a lot of sisters are coming nowadays and black men are saying no but anyways, you already know what it is. It's your boy Reclaiming Throne. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Send your relationship request to the email down below with a screenshot of your cash app so I know you're paying your ties. Man, y'all need to be in your remark for getting in with the BS. You already know. Reclaim your throne. Want to become an elite level athlete? Well, look no further. The Reclaim Your Throne Elite D1 training course is all you need to take your performance from subpar to the creme de la creme of athletes all around the world. The purpose of this course is to give you a comprehensive weight training, speed, flexibility, recovery, and endurance program that is meant to prepare young athletes for collegiate and professional sports. This course is packed with over two hours of creative, action-packed lifts narrated and coached by yours truly to assure increased strength, speed, flexibility, recovery, and endurance. Hey, I get it. Training alone can be tough and can even make you feel misguided or somewhat unmotivated. But with this course, I walk you step by step through each and every lift to make sure you're using the proper form to prevent injuries and that you're hitting the correct muscle groups to render maximum results. So what are you waiting for? It's now or never. So go ahead and get the training course today so you too can reclaim your throne.